All right, we're going to go ahead then to citizens' communication. Um, uh, Mr. Evans is the uh, first speaker. Is uh, Mr. Evans here? Quasi Evans. Next speaker is Julian Reyes. Reyes. Julian Reyes. Is he here? Either one. Okay. You have three minutes. Thank you. Can you hear me okay? Yes. <coughs> Good. Give me a moment to get uh, oriented here. Okay. Uh, my name is Julian Reyes. Um, I write for the, um, the Challenger newspaper, street newspaper. You guys are familiar with it. I'm uh, a local uh, homeless advocate, legal advocate, and I'm Homer the Goose's, the homeless goose uh, mascot from the 80s. I'm his chauffeur. Uh, you all know Homer the Goose. He's been here in City Hall. He's been all over town. Um, I'm here to speak on homelessness and some of the things that I've been noticing over uh, the last Ten or so years I've been in Austin, and the last six or so years that I've been uh, on the streets. Um, so, just to get started, I wanted to uh, thank the uh, uh, Mr. Adler, Mayor Adler, the City Manager, um, and Morgan. Uh, or no, where is the City Manager here? Of oh, and Kitchens, right? <coughs> and the interim City Manager. Okay, right and the city council. I want to thank you guys for listening to what I have to say here and uh, hopefully reacting. Um, let's see. The two most treasured things that you, um, that, that you all here have is, one, your word, and two, your image. The city's image and your own personal image and your own personal word and the city's word to the citizens of Austin. That's, the most, that's way more important than all the money that you're budgeting and spending and thinking about, and I know it's close to a billion dollars. Um, it's well, well, well over hundreds of millions of dollars that you're counting. And I'm told that we don't have any money for the homeless. Um, I don't, don't think that we're talking about the same kind of math. Um, so um, that being said, that your word and your image is important and that money is not above them. We need to honor your word and your, and your commitment. Um, last year in 2016... 146 statistical deaths of homeless occurred on Austin streets. That's 146 people died in, in your streets under your, under your care. Uh, they died of neglect. Uh, most people in Austin, according to the statesman and Richard Troxell, the Texas Rio Grande legal authority and the, and the challenger, most people in Austin that are homeless do not die of natural causes like would happen to uh, you and your family. They die of neglect, they die of violence, they die of abuse. Um, this number is really low because we're not counting in death custodies, uh, in, in custody deaths. We're not we're not counting people that, whose lives were destroyed through improper policing and criminalized for for ordinary human acts um, like sleeping. Um, the reason that the, that we have these problems because there's problems with the city ordinance ordinances. You can go ahead and finish your thought. That was your three. My minutes. thought. Is that three minutes? It is. Oh, well, there's a whole bunch here. City ordinances, policies, and pick, procedure pick that criminalize... That you want to end with. What? Pick the last thought you want to end with. Okay, right. So the reason we have these problems is because city ordinances, policy, and procedures criminalize ordinary human survival and necessary human functions, which is a violation of uh, DOJ directives, uh, recommendations, and international human rights law. I, I suggest that you guys contact me. My email is julian.reyes.human at gmail.com, and you can reach me through the Challenger newspaper. Uh, we will be, um, we, it's just, you can't save, you can't, the, what I'm told is that you guys don't have enough money to help with what we need with housing and meeting the, the homeless. And you can't, uh, you can't say that you don't have enough money to save money. That's just incorrect logic. You guys really need to spend the money to save the money because the way that we're doing it costs two or three times what it would do to do it properly, and much. it's against the law. Thank you, sir. All right, thank you. The next speaker we have is uh, Brian Say. 
And on deck is uh, Jeannie. It's our last speaker. You have three minutes, Mr. Kim. Oh, spangled pen over the land of the free and the home of the brave. That's a your country song. I'm from South Korea. I'm a Korean American. I have been here for 11 years since 2006 up until today. I'm here to support Sally Hernandez to arrest Greg Abbott. Thank there you. is no policy here. Mr. Where Kim? are they? What are they doing, the police? Mr. Kim, thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you. That's our last speaker. Uh, council, it is uh, 1241. We're going to break for lunch. We're going to stop for five or ten minutes for council to talk to us quickly about the textile matter. What time do you want to come back uh, from lunch? I would suggest uh, 145 uh, or 2. Does 145 work? Okay, let's come back at 145. Liz Lee, activist lizard. Namaste, y'all. Be safe.